With that, I'd like to invite our first speaker to the stage, Ms. Sherry Wagner with the Nature Conservancy, to talk a little bit about the Reef Resilience Network's training programs and mentored course that they've put together in partnership with the Coral Restoration Consortium. It's an excellent tool for up and coming and established practitioners and those interested in the field to learn more about reef restoration and how to join our community. Sherry? Hi, everyone. Thanks so much, Tom. Um, I also have Michelle Gralty, um, who will be working with me to just give you a quick overview of the Restoration Online course and other resources um, that the network has. So the Reef Resilience Network is a partnership between the Nature Conservancy and NOAA's Coral Reef Conservation Program. Um, we are about 4,000 members right now of coral reef managers, practitioners, and experts all working to improve um, coral reef health and management and restoration. Um, we started working with the CRC in 2017 and um, with the Coral Restoration Webinar Series. So probably many of you have been um, on the webinars or presented on webinars, so thanks so much. We're that will continue on, but we um, do, uh, I looked it up, we did about 16 webinars during that time with over 2,000 attendees. Uh, we do have one scheduled coming up uh, in the fall uh, after ReFuture, so just look for more information coming out about that. Um, and then, as Tom said, we were going to just briefly talk about the Coral Reef Restoration online course. It was first created in 2019. We just updated it in partnership with the CRC. Um, and so we just launched it in May this year. It has um, a couple um, of new lessons and content, one being on the project planning. Um, there's new content that's been added on that lesson. There's a brand new lesson on land-based coral nurseries, which many of you provided examples for in this course, so thanks so much for that. Um, there's also new content in restoring physical reef structure, as well as monitoring. Um, and if you have not taken the course already, I encourage you to take a look at it. It's interactive. It has case studies, um, resources for more information. It's available in French as well as Spanish. And um, it's free and open any time to take. So I'm excited to see that many of you in the room took our Coral Reef Restoration Mentored course, which we held in May and June of this year. We had over 500 people representing 85 countries and territories take the course, which was really exciting. And our goal was to provide best practice guidance to managers and practitioners. As you know, this field is rapidly changing, so we were really thrilled that we were able to both update and run another mentored version of this course. And it, as Sherry said, it's uh, now available in English and Spanish, and you can take it at any time. And I also see some of our mentors out in the audience. If you feel comfortable, if you could raise your hand. We had people from all over the world uh, providing insight throughout the course. And if you took the course yourself, come up and say hi to me and Sherry. We'd love to finally um, meet you all in person. And as she mentioned, we have a slew of other resources available on reef restoration. If you go to that QR code, it'll take you uh, to all these different things. So we've got our restoration toolkit online. We also have those CRC webinars along with article summaries. I know sometimes it's hard to find time to read five 20-page papers. So we created a paragraph with key management recommendations from those papers. So you can search them uh, along with our case studies by geographic location and topic as well. And then we've also got a fun little give out for you all. We have the Manager's Guide to Coral Reef Restoration Planning and Design. So this is a nice little bound book that you can read on the plane on your way home. Uh, if you want a hard copy of it, you can come find me and Sherry, but it's also available online. And we look forward to meeting you all.